What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ Prospect Profiles. So Turn focus in on uh, Paul Bittner of the uh, Portland Winterhawks of the Western Hockey League 2015 draft eligible forward. Um, we're, we're in 2015 now. Um, you know, I think we got four done total. I know. You know, so there's 206 more to go. 205 after this piece with uh, with Mr. Bittner, the Crookston, Minnesota native. Um, this is, will be this upcoming season will be his third year in the dub with Portland. Um, last year had 49 points in 63 games. You know, more than doubled his productivity from the year before. We had 23 points in 45 games, and it speaks. Well, if you saw my interview I did with Justin Kirkland at the draft. Uh, you know, these guys that that play on these deep teams, you know, like Kelowna, like Portland, you know, they, um, you know, you kind of get buried there. You're not getting a ton of power play minutes right away. Um, you know, maybe not seeing a whole lot of top six ice time. And you know what? That's, um, you know, that's par for the course. You know, we'd rather play on a, on a god-awful team and get a ton of minutes, put up a ton of statistics, or, you know, play on a great team and gradually grow in your role. And you look what Portland's been able to do. They have arguably the best track record of producing NHL talent in all of the CHL. And that's not, not, just not limited to the Western League. Um, and, you know, you look at the way uh, Bittner's going out there and, and fit into that mold. I mean, you know, it's, it's a leap of faith going from Minnesota to, uh, to Portland, Oregon. And, you know, especially his, his father was a high school hockey coach in Crookston. And, uh, you know, took a lot of heat for, for that move, you know, for, um, for his son going up there. But, you know, it's been unwavering, and, um, you know, the, the support, you know, the, with the family network there, and that, that's great to see, you know, as a prospect. I mean, it, you know, it sounds so stupid. Colin Coward in his book talked about maybe it's discriminatory or whatever, but having a guy that comes from a good family that's going to support them and not be, you know, hangers on, that's always kind of a good sign. And, um, you know, that's only one piece, one tiny, teeny tiny piece of the puzzle of Bittner. I think he's going to be a first round pick. You know, I think, you know, he's six foot four, two hundred and about 200 pounds, a little bit under. I think he maxes out at 6'5", 220. I would love, 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 love to see him add a little more snarl to his game, but I think that'll come with time. He had 22 goals this year. I think he'll be around 35, um, you know, maybe have 50 penalty minutes and could challenge your spot on the U.S. World Junior Team. I know he was invited to camp, but no handful was invited to camp, so per usual, USA Hockey doesn't know what it's doing. But again, I really like Bittner's game, and I think he will be a first-round pick. I think he has all the tools to be a, a very, very capable power forward in the NHL for many, many years. I think he's going to have a great year for the Winter Hawks, and you know that's just the way this team is. They don't rebuild, they reload. You know, every year is a whole new wave, and you know, even though he's been on the team for two years, I think his offensive um, ability is going to be more on display than they ever have been. And you know that's almost like getting a new player. You're getting a guy that was a bit player. Grown, no pun intended, growing into a full star and role, and that's going to be a very cool transition to watch. You know, seeing guys like him and um, fellow Minnesota native Keegan Iverson play expanded roles in the Winter Hawks, and you'll know, see what kind of success they have as a team next year. But anyway, that's all I got. Some sort of the power play with CJ Prospect Profiles on Paul Bittner of the Portland Winter Hawks. Stay tuned for episodes throughout the offseason and beyond. Later, guys.